I have a long history of moving around, so <laughs> um, basically my work pro process is starting from the materials I find and then continuing depending what I decide to work with. Things were quite a lot different here, the, the materials I used and but I, it made it made it more interesting for me because when you're you can't find your usual your usual materials, you have to find different ways. You have to find ways around, and that's always very inspiring. You actually find out that you end up doing the most interesting work when you have a feeling it's a total disaster. So. <laughs> Um, and yeah, I worked all with materials, all materials are found, found here in Pittsburgh, so I always work with second-hand materials, uh, basically things connected to the living space, uh, things that are functional but not, not too technical, things that are familiar basically, very sort of everyday objects, very things that you uh, recognize from somewhere, sort of our, our common surrounding, you know. So um, in Pittsburgh, I was basically going to a lot of thrift stores and flea markets and getting the materials here because I think it's quite interesting for me to work specifically with the materials from a certain place because that's where the, um, my, my future viewers are coming from. So it allows them to sort of create their own narrative for the installation um, depending on their own experience with a certain object. It is uh, it is a luxury for me to to have a surrounding when I can get all the materials I need and I can get all the help and the support I need and basically um, to make an image in my head come to life. So. <laughs>